Ladies and gentlemen, space enthusiasts and curious minds, today we're going to take a journey through time and space to explore one of the oldest and most fascinating regions of our Milky Way galaxy. But before we get started, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. We promise to bring you the latest and greatest discoveries from the cosmos. Now let's talk about the James Webb Space Telescope. This behemoth of an observatory has been making headlines since it launched. And it's no surprise why Webb is one of the most powerful telescopes ever built and it's already making groundbreaking discoveries. In fact, just a few days ago, Webb captured an image of the Messier 92 globular cluster that has left astronomers and space enthusiasts alike in awe. So, what did Webb see? Well, let's just say that creatures living on a planet inside the M92 star cluster would see a night sky that would put our own to shame. We're talking about stars, thousands of times brighter than those we see from Earth. But don't take our word for it. Stick around and we'll show you the image that's got everyone talking. This telescope is like the cool kid in high school who can see beyond the usual sights, and that's precisely what it did. It peered inside one of the oldest star clusters in our Milky Way galaxy, revealing a region of our galactic halo teeming with brilliant stars. The James Webb Space Telescope observed the Messier 92 globular cluster, also known as Emma 92, early after coming online last summer. It took only one hour to capture the sparkling image above. Can you believe it? Only one hour. Primarily built to study the most distant objects in the faraway reaches of the universe, Webb easily detected the multitude of stars inhabiting the M92 cluster some 27,000 light-years away, including the dim and cool ones that were invisible to its predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope. Now, that's like taking a super-powered microscope and seeing things that we could never see before. And the stars that Webb captured are tiny, only 0.1 the mass of our Sun. Roger Cohen, an astronomer at Rutgers University and one of the scientists behind the observations, said in the statement, This is very close to the boundary where stars stop being stars. Below this boundary are brown dwarfs, which are so low mass that they're not able to ignite hydrogen in their cores. So, we're basically looking at some of the tiniest and coolest stars in the galaxy. The image, captured by Webb's near-infrared camera, NERCAM, reveals only a small portion of the M92 cluster. The entire cluster is about 100 light-years wide and is teeming with 300,000 stars. Now that's a lot of stars. If an inhabited planet like Earth were to orbit one of those stars, the creatures on its surface would have a magnificent view of the night sky, which would shine with thousands of stars that would be thousands of times brighter than those humans can see from Earth. M92 is one of the oldest globular clusters in the Milky Way, consisting of stars that formed 12 to 13 billion years ago, when the universe was only hundreds of millions years old. It contains some of the oldest stars that we can find, or at least that we can resolve and characterize well, said astronomer Matteo Carrenti of the Italian Space Agency, who helped analyze the data. By studying ancient clusters such as M92, Astronomers can gain important insights into the history of not only our Milky Way galaxy, but the entire universe. Globular clusters like M92 are very important for our understanding of stellar evolution. Astronomer Alessandro Savino of the University of California, another member of the Webb Science Team, said in the statement, For decades they have been a primary benchmark for understanding how stars work. How stars evolve, M92 is a classic globular cluster. It's close by, we understand it relatively well. It's one of our references in studies of stellar evolution and stellar systems. Now let's take a moment to appreciate the sheer scale of the M92 cluster. We're talking about a group of stars that spans 100 light years. To put that into perspective, the distance from the Earth to the Sun is a mere eight light minutes. So, imagine trying to wrap your head around a cluster that spans more than a hundred times that distance. It's mind-boggling. But let's not forget about the James Webb Space Telescope itself. This powerful observatory has only been in operation for a short time, yet it's already making groundbreaking discoveries. Webb's predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope, has been in operation for over three decades and has revolutionized our understanding of the universe. 
However, Webb takes things to a whole new level. With its state-of-the-art instruments, Webb can observe the most distant and faint objects in the universe. It can detect the faint glow of galaxies that formed shortly after the Big Bang, and it can study the atmospheres of planets orbiting other stars. And now, as we've seen, it can peer deep into ancient star clusters and reveal their secrets. One of the most exciting things about the James Webb Space Telescope is that we don't yet know all the discoveries it will make. It's like opening a present on Christmas morning, but instead of finding socks or a tie, you discover a new planet or a mysterious object in deep space. So stay tuned, space enthusiasts. With the James Webb Space Telescope in operation, there are sure to be many more exciting discoveries to come. We're only scratching the surface of what we can learn about the universe, and Webb is helping us push the boundaries of our knowledge even further. In conclusion, the recent image of the M92 cluster captured by the James Webb Space Telescope is a testament to the incredible capabilities of this powerful observatory. We've seen a glimpse of the teeming stars that inhabit one of the oldest and most fascinating regions of our Milky Way galaxy. And, with Webb's advanced technology, we'll continue to unravel the mysteries of the universe and expand our understanding of our place within it. And that's a wrap, folks. We hope you enjoyed this journey through the M92 star cluster and the incredible image captured by the James Webb Space Telescope. As always, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more amazing content like this. And hey, while you're at it, why not click on the video on your screen to check out some of our other videos. We've got everything from black holes to exoplanets, and we promise to keep you entertained and informed about all things space. Until next time, keep looking up and dreaming of the stars. Who knows? Maybe one day we'll be talking about your groundbreaking discoveries here on our channel. Thanks for watching.